Ninth Circuit just awarded Trump $121,000 in attorney fees from Stormy Daniels. This is an addition, he says, to the $500,000 that she already owes him. What's up, guys? It's your boy, Benny. Man, turnabout is fair play and how the turntables turn. Donald Trump walked into a courthouse in lower Manhattan today, pled not guilty to a bunch of charges, and then walked out. Now... What happened on the same day is a ruling against somebody who is part of the reason that Donald Trump walked into that courthouse, a porn star named Stormy Daniels. Because porn star Stormy Daniels lost today in court the same day that Donald Trump went and pled not guilty. Stormy Daniels was found guilty again and awarded to Donald Trump nearly $122,000 in attorney fees from Stormy Daniels. Oh, ho, 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 ho. what's going on here? The award came hours after Trump pleaded not guilty to being charged with 34 felony counts falsifying business records in the first degree. Uh, we're going to go through that and prove exactly how false that is. Eric Trump tweeting, breaking the Ninth Circuit just awarded Trump $121,000 in attorney fees from Stormy Daniels just released in addition to the roughly $500,000 she already owes him. Harmeet Dillon, one of our favorite lawyers, saying congratulations to President Trump on his final attorney fee victory in favor of this morning, collectively, our firm obtained over $600,000 in attorney fees in favor of the meritless litigation uh, by Stormy Daniels. Holy schmoly. Fox News was covering this live on air and could not hold back their laughter. Interesting. You know, we're getting some messages from uh, people in the Trump um, circle. Uh, Eric Trump saying this has just happened. The Ninth Circuit just awarded Trump $121,000 in attorney fees from Stormy Daniels, order just released. This is an addition, he says, to the 500000 that she already owes him. Um, obviously, interesting timing uh, on that one, Brett. Yeah, well, <laughs> it's mean, not exactly the, it's not the stuff of a political slogan. Vote for me. I collected $121,000 from a porn star I had an encounter with. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> Bill, your thoughts on that, uh, on that judgment? I mean, I mean, that was expected. I mean, uh, he, he's entitled to those fees. It, the, the timing, I have to say, is very <laughs> curious. And it does raise this issue of, you know, sort of the underlying issues that we're talking about here, you know. Um, but I'm afraid, you know, we're going to this is just the beginning of a two years where, you know, we're going to have a lot of heavy breathing about a lot of legal developments. And it's unfortunate because it'll divert attention from the serious issues that the country face and we have to wrestle with in this election. Just in federal appeals court awards Trump additional $122,000 in legal fees. The timing on this order is legendary, they write. <laughs> in addition to $500,000, that's $600,000 if you're keeping track here. Don Jr. breaking Ninth Circuit gave dad the award. LOL. Glad she's out there saying her t-shirt sales are booming. She'll be able to afford to pay Trump. <laughs> oh my now what does stormy daniels have to say about this okay so uh here's stormy daniels uh not safe for work twitter account it says she's an award-winning director writer <laughs> okay got it good uh thank you everyone for your support and love so many messages coming in i can't respond also i don't want to spill my champagne oh merch autograph overs are pouring in too thank you few extra days for shipment got it okay yeah that's right so maybe you can maybe you can pay trump uh trump pleads not guilty some epic photos in this article this is donald trump sitting there pleading not guilty and speaking with his attorneys donald trump staring down the camera absolutely legendary photo here i mean you just you're not gonna get better than this donald trump posting on truth social seems so surreal wow they are going to arrest me. I can't believe this is happening in America. MAGA, this the media circus was bananas. Is it going to matter, ladies and gentlemen? Well, I mean, the public, of course, understands a couple of things here. One, uh, all of the Stormy Daniels stuff was completely and utterly fraudulent. Stormy Daniels must pay $300,000 to Donald Trump. But this was the original uh, 2018 ruling where she lost. And now she's lost again The public knows that it's fraudulent. And then they look over here at these kind of things from Technofog. It's great, great attorney saying there's a curious omission in the Donald Trump indictment because the indictment was unsealed today. The specified federal law that Trump violated. So where exactly is the federal law that says that you're supposed to use campaign funds to pay personal expenses? 
uh, because that don't exist. The defendant, Donald J. Trump, repeatedly and fraudulently fal uh, falsified New York business records to conceal criminal conduct that hid damaging information from the voting public uh, during the 2016 election. Hiding damaging information from the public is literally called politics. That's the that's politics. What do you think they did with the laptop? Hunter Biden laptop. We should. I mean, they got to all be put in jail, right? If that's if this is a crime. From August 2015 to December 2017, the defendant orchestrated a scheme with others to influence the 2016 presidential election by identifying and purchasing negative information. This would be where you cite the code, the federal code that Donald Trump broke, but they can't do that. They can't do that. So Trump pleads not guilty as indictment is sealed and the indictment is hot garbage. It's not working, ladies and gentlemen. It's not working. Poor Trump being indicted? Definitely not. That man is the GOAT. He ran the fuck out the country. They just trying to set him up, for real. Trump 2024, for sure. Trump 2024. No, no. It's a witch hunt. They're doing whatever they can to get rid of him because they know he's powerful and they, they know he can actually do a good change in this country. Damn My right. boy Donnie's watching. You have more supporters than you ever know, bro. Oh, I just seen that two days ago. Nope. They on trick y'all dumb to get Trump out the chair, and now look how that I'm backfired on y'all dumb. Trump got my back. Guy. Trump for life. I love that guy. <laughs> Trump for life. Stormy Daniels is uh probably not too excited right now. Actually, a little bittersweet. Bittersweet for everyone because they know now that Hillary Clinton, Bill Clinton, uh, Barack Obama, they're all fair, fair game. The Bidens, they're all fair game. Turnabout is fair trade, and uh, whatever goes around comes around. So, oh my, how the turntables turn. We will keep turning it up to 11. Save America. It's your boy Benny, right here. See ya. Thank you for watching. Our channel's here to meme the libs until they cry and then to meme them crying. Their tears, they taste just like sweet, delicious ice cream. Salty, too. We ridicule the establishment and the libs because of you. Your support keeps us going. So if you like what you saw, please punch the subscribe button, click like, and ring the little bell so that you know when we're live. Don't you want to know when we're live? And make sure that you subscribe to our email list just in case the plug gets pulled, as tends to happen. If you want to see more of our videos, click here or here. My name is Benny Johnson. Stay free. Base Patriots.